Ladies and gentlemen, this is Joe's Classic Video Games back with another cool arcade game video for you this evening. We have been working on this Nintendo Red tent for our buddy Mike, and we finally got it up and running. So if you haven't seen one of those, these, where have you been? We filmed three other videos before this one, but we figured we'd do one where we actually played the game a little bit. So we're going to get Joe to play it here in a minute. And while I film, what do you think about that? And I always film with a real steady camera like this. So it'll be great. So, uh, uh, <laughs> stay tuned. So if you haven't heard of, of these, this is a Nintendo Versus Red Tint Cocktail Cabinet. That thing can have the legs lowered where it sits down closer to the ground, but right now it's high enough, the control panel is about where a normal control panel is. Right? So it can actually be played standing up right now. Um, but the little leg extender kit down there on the bottom can be taken off and it makes it sit f much farther down on the ground. It actually almost makes it look like one of the mushrooms from the Magic Kingdom, or the... Wait, is Mario's place called the Magic Kingdom? No, that's that's Disney. One of the mushrooms from the Mushroom Kingdom. There we go. Um, it's playing Excite Bike right now. That's the noise that you're hearing. But uh, they made these where they have a game board that puts a game on both sides. So there's two monitors, one power supply, there's a monitor on this side, monitor on that side, both uh, displaying completely different arcade games. So uh, some of the games could actually be four players at the same time. There is a tennis game where you can play doubles. And so two players on this side with the screen looking at the other team, and then two players on that side with the screen looking at, th at this team. Four players at the same time. They had about 30 games for this thing. It's got a lot of the screws and stuff out of it now and the locks where you can just open it up, but... If you uh, didn't see our other videos, you got two monitors tucked in there on top of each other, and the game board is in the other side. These came out in about 1984. So let's read the instructions for Versus Super Mario Brothers. Now this is not the regular home Super Mario Brothers. It's slightly different. It looks like somebody was talking about it online the other day it looks like the Japanese version came out first for the Super Famicom and then this version came out and then the Nintendo version in America came out um, which I guess would have been a copy of the uh, the uh, Famicom version what's up with the focus it's on auto focus what's the deal there we go now it's trying to cooperate what in the world that's a little better. First is Super Mario Brothers. Mario's quest is to save the princess. And I believe this is official artwork. I mean, this is a reprint of it, but this is how it originally looked. <laughs> Look at this. Crash. How to operate. Walks left, walks right. Ducks when Super Mario. Runs, throws fireballs, jumps and swims. Punch enemies from below. How to destroy enemies. Jump on top of enemies. Hit these blocks for coins. Collecting enough coins gives extra lives. Hint. Look for hidden coins. Look at him just curb stomping a turtle. Look at that. Look, his hat fell off. Look at the glee in his face. And he says, gee. Try to pick up. Mario grows to Super Mario. Or if you get a mushroom. Super Mario changes to Fiery Mario. He can destroy enemies with fireballs. Be careful. Some enemies cannot be destroyed. And the star makes Mario invincible for a short time. So these came with... You could get kits to change the game. So you could change this side into uh, Castlevania if you wanted to. And you would change this artwork. And you would put the new chips in. And it would be Castlevania. Simple as that. All you'd have to do is change that one piece of artwork. Pretty wild. There were also some gun games where you would had a big holster that you took one of these buttons out, or I think the, the joystick out, and it hung down off the front of the cabinet. So this side right now has Excite Bike installed in it. It's missing some of the coin uh, bezels and stuff. Mike's got those that he's going to put back on him. He just wanted us to work on some of the electronics for him, so we got it up and running. So this is Versus Excite Bike, which I believe is also slightly different than the Nintendo version. We'll play it here in a minute and see if we can spot anything different. Move joystick to select one of three different skill levels. Finish in the top five to qualify for the next race. Change lane up, change lane down. 
To jump with the high front wheel to do a wheelie, hold back. To jump with the low front wheel, press forward. You want to do that because you want to land on the ramp the right way. Accelerator button, push to accelerate. Quickly tap to remount the bike fast. Wow! Hey Joe, if you wreck and you quickly tap the A button, you get to the bike quicker. That's crazy, I didn't know that. Turbo button B, push for turbo boost. Watch the temperature meet, uh, meter to prevent overheating. So you can't, uh, you can't, oh, you don't want to hold it down the whole time. Game is over when a race exceeds the three minute time limit. Extra bike is awarded at 100,000 points. The secrets of jumping. Speed determines the length of the jump. The angle of the bike determines the height. For best results, adjust the angle of bike to the angle of the landing area. Do willies to safely pass over speed bumps. Leaning too far backwards, or leaning too far back, bike flips backwards. So hold back if you're going high, and then low, and then don't. Do, don't. <laughs> Where are we? To prevent overheating, high pitch sound warns of overheating danger. Overheating results in a penalty. Pass through the stripes, the arrows, to lower the temperature fast. I thought that made you... Joe! <laughs> the arrows don't make you go faster. They just lower the temperature. Yeah, I knew that. Unbelievable. Knock down other riders. Use the rear wheel to knock down riders. You will fall if you're hit by other riders' rear wheels. Ah, what do you think about that? So I'll show you the board in here. If I can open it without breaking it. So this is the game board, and again, we did a whole other bunch of videos on this if you want to see more about it. It slides in there, and there's two sets of games on it. Some of these have uh, little daughter boards where it can play even. Um, instead of just being an EEPROM swap, it has a little daughter board that has some, I guess, extra um, integrated circuits on it to make it uh, <laughs> play different stuff. So uh, there's a little door back down here for a cash box. That's been removed. It's easy to lose stuff like that. Another one down here. But we don't get these too often anymore. They're a little strange. But this was a this was an American released game. These were these these were released in America. Um, it almost looks Japanese, and of course Nintendo's a Japanese company, but. Uh, they were all over the good old USA. You may have played one yourself. As a matter of fact, you may have played this one. Let's check it out. We're, we're going to play Mario first and see how that goes. Okay, Joey's going to play it. Go ahead, Joe. Well, let's get it, Joe. We'll see if Joey's any good at Mario. Have you ever played Mario before, Joe? No. You never played it before? Never in my life. It's a fun game. Killed that one. Hey, how come there wasn't a, usually Joe, you probably wouldn't know, but usually there's a little block there that's not there in this version. Mm -hmm. I hear this version's different. Oh, that back got you. About spurred your ass. 2000. Uh huh. That's my favorite music in the whole part of the game. probably complain if I didn't go back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's not how I'd do it. Really, you know, actually, you shouldn't be, you know, you shouldn't have destroyed your, your ladder there by hitting that brick. I've found that. <laughs> <laughs> Look at you cheating. Look at him cheating.
Well, everything is about the same as the Nintendo version, which you've never played, Joey, but everything's about the same. I remember when I was a kid, when I got to this board, I thought, wow, in this level, the castles are bigger. They must be rich in this level. Well, that didn't work. Nope, it doesn't work. Oh, you started a two-player. Oops. Well, I'll show you how that works. He uses those. <laughs> yeah, the way it works is you just use the other controller. I wonder if we've got the... You know what? I'll bet we've got the wires reversed, because I think it did that on me earlier, too. I, now that I think about it, I'm pretty sure I hit one player. Those are minor details. It's like dance music. Notice it has a stripe on the side of the screen. A lot of the Versus games have that. Never realized he turned red too. Oh yeah, I guess he does. Yep. You know? Luigi turns red when he gets the fire thing. That makes sense, I guess. Oh, did you see that? The um, the um, the score was popping up on the left side of the screen because it was cl so close to the right side of the screen. It wrapped around. Joe <laughs> said, screw the cheese, let me out of the trap. Back gotcha. Do you die if you go off the top of the screen? Don't try it. I don't. <laughs> I don't really care. But doesn't that smash you? Remember. I notice you're short. Now you get the explosions. Oh, this is that hard one. This is one of those games that gets harder as it goes along, isn't it? Thanks, sir. Right on their head. Now, how come he doesn't break a leg when he falls all that way? 
think that'd be the end of Luigi. That didn't work out quite how you planned. You thought you were going to cheat again, didn't you? Yep. I remember when I was a kid having a problem right there. I think you got to wait till it goes real low. I ain't got time for that. I ain't got time for that crap. Oh yeah, you're up in world four. Well, Joe, I think you got all the buttons working right. Got to mess with that wire. But... That one wire seems to be off a little bit. I'm going to tell Mike that you didn't check the wire. He's going to have to go back and recheck all my work. You think so? <laughs> He's going to have to back you up. We got to finish the game, Joe, or it's going to keep making noise while we play Excite Bike. Joe's ready to play Excite Bike. You tried to get killed, weren't you? Unbelievable! All right, you got to ride it way down, Joe. And then death. Yep. Death by turtle. Ooh, you did the hole. Mm. Killed by a, a, a spiky turtle. Mario's dead. Let's see if Luigi can beat him. Mario got 28,000 points. This is after that anybody kept track of the uh, of the uh, points, though. Push button to continue. Does it let you run it down? Nope. They want you to. They want to wait every second to see if they can get that other quarter from you. Oh, Luigi ain't got a chance. He's way back. I don't know. He's got a higher got score. 51. How'd that happen? You must have got more. Uh, Oh, you did have that one part where you got the explosions. Joey! Whoops. All right, that's that. 52,500. All right, let's spin around on this side. Now, we're going to come over here and play Excite, Excite of the Bike. Well, this is an exciting game here, I'll tell you that much. Challenge race, number one. All right, now, Joe, don't wreck. So this one's only one player, right? Yeah. All right. I'll have to read the instructions. Look at that, folks. That's me. Look at that raster goodness. All right. So they do like these pilot swaps on every board. It's kind of neat. Maybe not this board. I guess there's the time trial and then the race. Oh, Joey put on the damn fuel. Oh, you overheated, Joey. I thought I was going to make that arrow. Wrecked that guy. No remorse. Uh. Joe. You tried to Tony Stewart him. I saw what you were doing. <laughs> Unbelievable. Do you think we'll get kicked off YouTube for me saying that?
get him. <laughs> yeah, but I get it. Sucker! Sucker, sucker, free! <laughs> All right. Name registration. Joe Tholomew. Apparently you're the greatest that's ever played this game, Joe. Apparently. <clears throat> World record. Boy, look at the colors. I wonder if they were the same on the Nintendo. I don't think... It always looks different to me. I don't know. Boy, this is a cool game. Hmm. Second place, Joey. And I wasn't even racing anybody. You're starting to slip. <laughs> wow. Track number dos. Now come on. Did you see that crap? The guy like just flew away from you. Oh, did you see that? They were trying to trick you into taking the arrow, but there was a guy wrecked right in front of you. Boy, he busts a hell of a wheelie whenever he hits a wheelie. He puts his thumb up there. Boy, that was slick, the way you hit that one. Seems like sometimes, depending on how fast you're going, they make you wreck farther away from your bike. So it takes you longer to walk back. Oh, that's the worst yeah. when you wreck up going up the hill. Oh, man. Oh, no. You're way over here, Joe, because yeah. you lost. Yeah. Oh, man. Sorry. You know what that means. I'm crying. Yep. Time for another. And you were playing beginner. Yep. It does say press one or two to start, so it was going to let you... Uh... Oh, you're on the next one. Let's see what the next stage looks like. It was going to let you... Boy, he's faster now. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you got to hit a wheelie. It seemed like it was going to let you start a two-player. You know what we're going to have to get into uh, film after this is an evil Knievel pinball machine. Think we'll ever get one? I don't know if we'll ever get an Evil Knievel pinball machine that we should film. Uh huh. Boy, you looked like you knew what you were doing, but now you got to do it with five people on the track. Good luck. They keep getting in my way, is the problem. Look at that. Adam. Did you see that crap? You got nitrous. Like I'm that damn stupid. This, this Nintendo game is insulting my intelligence. I don't know if you go any farther doing that, but it feels like you do. Boy, it looks cool. <laughs> Look at him. 
Look at him. Did you see what he did? Man, they cheat. Ain't nobody ever cheated more than the fake computer playing bikes on Excite Bike Cheat. Joe's putting a move on him. Man, you went from last place to first place. Yep. We'll play one more, one more track, and then we're done. Oh, I want to know who you are again. Your name was registered. Bonus stage. Oh, I forgot about this. Is this on the Nintendo? I don't know if I've ever played this. I don't think this is on the Nintendo. I don't remember ever seeing this. Huh. Oh, you were trying to do an Evil Knievel. Oh. I guess you run out of nitrous here. I mean, uh, turbo. What in the hell? I have never seen that. That's not on the... Donnie would know. Yeah, Donnie would know. Where's Donnie when you need him? Challenge number four. This one is. Yeah, I've seen this one. I remember that. Killing it. Uh-oh. You know what happened last time you came in second place? You were yeah. dead last, kicking cans. Yeah. All right, folks, there you go. What the hell was that? All right, folks, leave your, that third guy cheats every time. All right, folks, leave your comments below. Tell us what you remember about Excite Bike. Was that level in the Nintendo version, like the home version? I can't remember. Give us a thumbs up for taking the trouble to film it for you. Give Joe an attaboy for being so good at it. Boy, he's great, ain't he? Look at him. And he's stuck in the mud. <laughs> Big old dirt bike out there just stuck in the mud, Joe. Little Johnny Cash lingo for you. So uh, leave your comments below. Let us know what you think. Thank you to everybody that's been using our Amazon links. If you don't know about that, if you uh, are going to buy something on Amazon, if you click our link down below, which is in several countries now, before you buy something on Amazon, it gives us a piece of your order. That's right. We get some of Jeff Bezos' money, and we're stacking it up. Oh, no. Okay. Well, that worked out pretty good because you didn't have far to uh, walk back to the bike. So we appreciate everybody that's been doing that. Thank you. And uh, uh, also check out our brother's channel, my brother, Donnie, where he's always working on something fun. I'm usually over there with him. We're uh, uh, usually working on my truck or his truck, or he's been working on farm equipment and his tractor and all kinds of stuff like that. So it has nothing to do with uh, arcade games or pinball machines, but pretty entertaining if you're looking to be entertained. And I'm over there with him a lot too. Mm, you got your spokes uh, intertwined, Joe. Yep. Well, I bet you lost. Yep. I bet you lost that time. We're crying over on the side. Yeah, look. They had the little can ready for you. Did you see it? Yep. It was sitting over there. Just so you can tell before they even pop up. Unbelievable. Extra play. Huh. 
Okay, so that, that was that. Sound. That was what that sound was. Huh. All right, so there you go, people. So leave your comments below again, and thank you for watching. We appreciate you hanging out with us. We'll see you on the next video.